even there, even there, things are not perfect. So how do you make the perfect resus knowing that? Because the perfect resuscitation is the best you interacting with an optimal team in an ideal environment, providing expert resuscitation to a patient with a reversible, life-threatening presentation. That's it. That's what we want to achieve. That's what we want to see. But it's so hard because there's so many layers to it. It is like a cake. And the optimal resuscitation is the cherry that goes on the cake. But it's a layer cake. And there are personal and professional and organizational layers that you have to have in place. Scott gave us some great information on day one about how we can look after ourselves on a personal level to cope with the pressures of the job from day to day. Um, but as well as that, with our professional stuff, building our knowledge, skills, attitudes, so we can become masters. But the workplace is everything, isn't it? Having the right team culture, the right systems, SAPs, guidelines. And culture really is everything. The single best book I've ever read is called The Culture Code by Dan Coyle. I strongly recommend it if you're interested in this stuff. And what he did is he looked at a number of different high-performance organizations across multiple domains and looked for the common threads. And it was quite simple. Everyone in the organization shared a vision about what they were there for. The leaders were open and honest about their own shortcomings. They shared vulnerability. Everything they did was looked at in an open and honest, blame-free, curious way with the simple goal of getting better. And this after-action review is something that we should aim to be doing after every resus if we can. We use a thing called stop five because we try and get it done in five minutes um, and we action points um, and we, we actually do that. We actually fix things and change things. And so as a team, we're learning. As an organization, we're getting better. But culture takes forever to fix, but don't give up. <laughs>